She probably smells like a Percocet. If a Percocet oh. had a smell, it would be sexy red. I'm here with Duke, and I just duked it out with your sister's box. 12 rounds, kid. Now that thing is dying. Yeah, but let me ask you something. If I fall asleep with my mouth open, does that mean I'm giving a ghost head? Hey, all the time. <laughs> 80% of the time, 100% of the time. What would happen if you hit the deck like that? Oh, you guys got to get shot 100%. Got to come back and shoot him. Oh, 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 David Dobrik. David Dobrik. Dobrik. David yeah, Dobrik. I don't like that. David Dobrik. You ever see his shit on Snapchat? No. Fuck that, dude. He's huge, bro. He doesn't definitely. get ass. Yeah, but he's definitely making millions. And when you make oh, yeah. millions, you get ass. Mm. You know, bro, you could literally be gay and get ass. How are you, fellas? Are you struggling getting it up? You know, that little pecker in your downstairs area? Actually, matter of fact, are you struggling keeping it up? I know. I know. I remember those days. But now my sex life is a marathon, not a sprint, thanks to Blue Chew, baby. Blue Chew got me doing all the right moves, man. It's got me doing karate in bed sometimes. Not going to lie to you. Get Blue Chew today to expand your abilities in the sheets like a beast. And you know what, fellas? You can have your first month free with my promo code in the description below. Let's get into this episode. I'm not gonna lie. If I was to look up, if I was to look up New York on Google, <laughs> you would literally show up just on the yeah. screen. I that love it. That's Everything. good. That the I parachute have. pants. I love it all. That's the, the nobody man. ever says that about somebody from Staten Island. Really? Yeah, Staten Island's like a different world. Literally is a different world. It's I don't like, like Jersey, bro. It's like fucking we're close to Manhattan. You can travel to Manhattan, but you also have like a Jersey lifestyle as far yeah. as people have houses, not buildings. And, yeah. you know, it's way less cluttered. Stand on so, the best for that. All right, folks. We have a very special, special guest for this episode. The man, the myth, the legend. Jake, also known as Jakey Botch. Is Botch your full last name? No, Bobaccia. 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 We got Jake Bobaccia in this bitch, folks, for this episode of Duke well, It got, Out. Got me giving out my government, nah. Yeah, this guy's got a couple of cheeseburgers down there. How you feeling, brother? Bro, you look really? great, though. Yeah, I ate Panda Express before I got here. Did you really? Then I had a, a pumpkin, no, pumpkin loaf from Starbucks and a coffee, and then I also just picked up Doritos on the way here. Wow. Talk Not about good. diabetes. So look, yo, just look how like bloated I am. But I do, I, I do want to talk about how you'd start. Man, perky sets I take a day. I want to know how the fuck that started. Doing perks? I know you don't do perks, well, but I I'm saying how, how did you buy? Nah, because it's fucking the neighborhood. That's what the that's neighborhood just how is. how it is, like, right? It's like yeah. all. And that's not how it was when you grew up, like, everybody's doing drugs? Yeah. And they would always, but I was always, like, scared. Like, where I was at growing up, <laughs> Drugs was not like a crazy big thing. Smoking weed was. Nah, pills took over Staten Island at a certain point. Where was See, like, I was never around that. That was huge. Perfect. I was never on that. Florida was bad too. A lot of places were bad with opioids and shit like that. Yeah. Just fucking boy, the kid of pain. What's the what's the what's the place in? Uh, is it in Philly? It's like Zombie Land. Oh, I've seen, seen that, that on TikTok and Instagram. Bro, I I, I go down a people, rabbit hole. Yeah, people are bad, bro. That's heroin. Walking like zombies. Nuts. I don't know how you could ever f- want to feel like that. I don't know. I guess for the first couple seconds, you're in like Disneyland, and then that shit starts to kick in, and you feel like <laughs> shit. So you gotta like, like fucking. Heroin. But uh, all right. So you you obviously you started off during COVID TikTok. That was like your big like. Nah, 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 nah. Not not during COVID. Before COVID. Oh, it was before COVID. Yeah, yeah. But not just before COVID. Like just never like trying to make content. Just trying to be. Just, be uh, you. Yeah. Just like. Uh, I would laugh at things. That fucking thing is funny. And then I would just film it. You know, like the same way just me and my cousin just sit there and laugh at yeah. things. I would just share that with the world and just be comfortable with sharing it. I know. And yeah. I, I, was, I, was, I was telling the twins too, it's like being where you're at and like growing up in Staten Island is just content as it is. It's just who we are. That person is just, that person's a real person who like we, we embody and stuff like that. That I've met zillions of those people around my life. Because I started, I don't even know. Even your guy. Your guy is somebody. What do you the mean? character you like, you know? Oh, man? yeah. Oh, yeah. Like that guy, bro, who scrunches his lip all the time. I'm a complete and, asshole on the internet. It's not even, it's just that person is a real person. You know yeah. what I mean? You're not that 24 nope. 7. But the funny, the funniest part about the character is that there is somebody that's oh, right, like this 24 7. This person is just this. 
Like I, la- I laugh at that. I laugh. And at isn't it. it weird? Like you see, like obviously you see that as their content, and then you see them in person, and it's like, what the fuck? This that, guy's that what different or that? Was the I'm same? saying no, that they're exactly the same. Like yeah, we talk yeah. about certain creators that are exactly the same. Obviously, yeah, yeah. we'll mention anybody because I don't want to talk shit on them, but it's like that's just not fucking. It's, it's, it's fucking. But you can't, you can't really get mad at it because it's like, but I don't know. Is it, is it fake? Because it's not really them being fake. Yeah, it's not them being fake at all. But the thing is, is it's not us being fake neither. It's us just laughing. Like, the yeah. character we made is to laugh. I know, but I it's... I just want to laugh at everything, bro. I don't try to be taken too seriously or nothing. I just want to fucking Nobody laugh. Nobody knows how to laugh, bro. That's what it is. Nobody yeah. knows how to fucking laugh. Some Everybody. people do. Some people are uptight. Horrible. Pick but, my um, nose on camera for you. Uh, how is the... Uh, so, you're obviously still <laughs> working and shit and, like, keeping that. Do you feel like... Doing like Percocets I, is the best thing for me? No. Obviously, I, I, I'd hope you're not doing fucking perks on a weekly basis, brother. Because <laughs> nah. then I'm going to be coming in and be like, here, here's a fucking water, glass what, of water. What, um, I'm saying, I, like, in terms of, like, would you ever quit your job to do social media full time? Yeah, when I made fucking more yeah, than enough $6 money million. Do, yeah. dollars. I don't know, did we speak? No, that's funny. We spied another podcast I did. They were talking about, like, how much money. Bro, you need you need 6 to $11 million dollars. Of course, more than $11 million is beautiful, but, like, to stop working and stop doing yeah, whatever bro. you're doing, you know? Yeah, but to do both, bro, is, like... It's hard. You know what I mean? I like, you're... Con- like, that's why I love your content, because you're just on the... You're on the fly with it. Yeah, like, you see it as it comes. Yeah. Like, I heard you talking about, which is another thing I wanted to bring up, you were talking about on the podcast that um, a lot of your posts are from your story. Yeah, yeah, a lot of, like, your good... Yeah. Which is... I do that shit sometimes too. Yeah. Like if I see a story's getting like I don't know, fucking. I know a lot of shares. shares. Yeah, yeah. You could translate swiping it. up on it. That's what I can't stand because I know that there was golden stories I've posted that would have been good posts like yeah. that. Land. And I say that because like when we look back at the page and shit like that, it's it's not even like look at the numbers more as like man, remember that point in time in my in our life. That's what sucks when our first page got taken. It sucked because it was like a museum. You know what I mean? Like wait, with, taken down. Yeah, my first page got taken down. Well, for too many, can you, like, I was doing, like, mushrooms on camera uh-huh. and stuff like that. I was doing crazy stuff. Did I have a lot of big following? No, only, like, 17,000. But the thing is, is it was, like, I, I us at, like, 6,000, 7,000 was, like, cult following. Mm. It wasn't like you needed to hit 80,000 before you have, like, a following. Like, people just really get a kick out of it. The That's fucking crazy. outlandishness. So, it, we had a little smaller following, but it was... Wolf it. it was real yeah and and at 17 we got taken down it was disheartening because you know what i mean it feels like somebody could just take what you've done oh, and brother. yeah i know that's Preaching that's why bro quiet. when you told me when you told me that that's like that's heartbreaking <laughs> he got his taken like bro uh, i woke up one day like both three TikTok times and bro. instagram and on the same day bro on the same day and that and, and that how TikTok, many did you have at that i point, had three million bro? on tiktok wow, and two hundred thousand on instagram bro Gone in one day. Uh, 17,000 we had a problem with. Because it just feels like somebody took something from you. Like, yeah, and like I said, I can't physically say, what the fuck did you just do to me? It's just, you're, you're grabbing that air. Who did that? Yeah. Who, who did that to me? But then again, too, it's like, like you were, <laughs> it's like you were in a dark room and got punched in the face. And then the lights came on and there's 100,000. Oh, who just hit me? <laughs> just, you, you don't know what happened to you. And there's nobody you could put physical harm on. Like right now, if... You know, uh, if, um, you know, well, somebody did something bad to me, I could physically, wow, bro. Yeah. When Facebook and Instagram take you and You're YouTube done. take you, there's, there's nobody, nobody you can, nobody you can, you can reach out to. by the chest and say, what the fuck did you just do to me? You know, it sucks. But that's why I, I, you bouncing back from that is tough. I did it like three times, too. That's crazy. But yeah, it was just you got, like Because you have like what it is is a cult following, bro. And that's what you want to, you want to, you I don't want to do nothing. I just want to be me and cool. You but want if you're it, gonna be if you're gonna be followed, you want it to be a diehard fan base that not just fan base, like diehard, like enjoy, like man, this kid is just like me. Like this is, yep. you know what I mean. And a yeah. lot of people don't have that. A lot of people have a lot of following, but it's just like oh, this is a one time overnight thing. It's though. not, yeah, and it's not like man, I love that person, who that person is. That's why I tell you, like sometimes showing, showing that side of me. The, the side that isn't. It's kids, you know, when you do the lip up and you, yeah, asshole. asshole, you know what I mean? Like, that's not your all the time. Yeah. But I know, then but again, you said bro, that's some, why they follow me. I know, but sometimes you said they have they have a, a bad reaction to that. Like, don't be a pussy. But mm-hmm. you're not being a pussy, bro. You're just a human. 
But the thing is, TikTok too. Instagram tells you that, or TikTok tells you that. It's me. No, Instagram. Really? Yeah. No, oh. TikTok. I've gotten on like. But and guys I, say, and people say in the comments, like they don't like when you're just like a regular person who has a family. No, they're like, "Yo, bro, you're soft." I brought. That's another thing. I won't post my. I won't post. I used to love posting my mom and my sister and shit. Yeah, like life. never again. Never again. That's why, I love posting my my family and stuff like that. But um, the sit like you know what I mean. It's just not something that the, the mother of my kid is no, like absolutely. so yeah. is so fond about, and like uh, out of respect and just like you yeah. know love for that situation. That's what I I hold that to. Like you know what I mean. I've I t- but I totally understand her too. Like as far as like what the fuck do I you know what I mean? I'm I'm interesting enough without filming my child absolutely. and stuff like that. Hundred percent. I would love to. It's a bittersweet. I would love to bring my family into it you know as far as my child and and stuff like that as far as like being able to create and and everything like part of me is like yeah that's awesome yeah but then the other part is like why subject somebody you know what i mean like yeah it's especially if the person i'm raising her with yep feels you know if if she was gung-ho about it and and i have i was like yeah kind of and not kind of maybe i'd go with it because she was gung-ho about it but i'm split in half and then if she's like yo what what really do you benefit from it? And I'm like, yeah, you're right. I know. Because, yo, it's whatever life, bro, life is awesome if you're a fucking good person and you know how to work with somebody. Yeah. You know, like it's, it's her child too. And, and and that's, you know, let's talk Both about how you want to do this. You know what I mean? I'll, yeah, I, I'm not trying to be a Gestapo on how I want the kid to be raised. And I hope you're not trying to be a Gestapo on your end. Bro, parent, bro you know what's but that's crazy? Just in life. Parents do that though, dude. Like yeah. they'll have a kid and they immediately People they immediately that. make Instagram accounts for them. They oh, yeah. immediately like, like the fucking kid doesn't even know how to walk yet. Yeah. And they're just shoving it in their face uh-huh. right away. Mm-hmm. Like, dude, let that thing figure out how to fucking live life a little bit. Yeah, but you know that screen mean? time and shit. I don't want my daughter to have screen time and stuff. They're, they're going to be fucked no matter what, bro. They're, they're, <laughs> no, for real, it's really bad. But Sad, you could just dude. hold. Because you know what? If you don't let your kid ever see anything like TikToks and Instagram, then your kid is a weirdo who, who isn't. They're not like fitting in to what's in going on. Who isn't in touch with yep. life unless you live in fucking, you know. West Nyack, New York, where there's 350 people, and it's like, ah, oh, yeah, the kid doesn't know the new TikTok trend. That's not bad. Like, then your kids are fucking out of touch, weirdo. Or you could here have all of life, and then they they become melted in the brain. So you got to find a happy medium. Kids definitely fuck no matter what, bro. And especially like I, I like I was talking about it too in the last part I did. Like I didn't have a phone until I literally did not have a phone until like. My sophomore year of high school. That's crazy. Literally, Sick. I'm and not. My, and the only me. fucking number you that didn't I had. Have, have a phone nope. in junior high school, bro. No, I didn't have a phone until my my. It might have been my late freshman year. I'm older than you, and everybody had phones in junior high school. The sidekick and shit like that. Yeah, I don't know. Your parents were strict or something? No, they weren't strict. I just, I, I don't know. I just never, I just never had you one. You never looked to the right and said, "Why the fuck do those kids have cell phones and I don't?" That's what kids are fucked. No. Maybe you don't was, remember kids having cell phones in junior no, high school? No, I remember too? them. And then, or no, I had it, it was a phone, but it only worked when I was like home. It didn't have service. It only worked off Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi. So I just never brought it around yeah, me because yeah, I was yeah. never able to call anybody with it. It yeah. was like fucking. It was useless. Yeah. I couldn't go on it. The only thing I would do was put it open and check the time. Yeah. I remember it was it was that, but Sophomore I didn't have. Sophomore is crazy. Yeah, yeah. And then my uh, <coughs> my. That was when I started paying for because I started making a little money like working at a fucking restaurant. Or but I'm hustling them pizzas, nah. Me? Mm-hmm. Pizza? No, I never worked at a pizza joint. What were you doing? I at was the restaurant? doing. Uh, I was a busboy at some fucking clam shop. I used Man to fitting clams. for the last name Gomez. I know. Just so busboy. Do I look Spanish? Yeah, you got a little Spanish. Do I really? You got a little yeah. Spanish in me, yeah. but I don't speak any of it. Yeah, I'm Puerto Rican and I don't speak Spanish neither. I keep. I don't really see Puerto Rican. Yeah, I'm ah, just a mutt. You kind of have like a only when you talk with that you you sound Italian. That fake ass Italian. When I'm like you fucking douchebag. Yeah, when you you nothing beats the uh, the 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 the, I'm not, <laughs> the one that you have to it. I say it to my boys all the time because I tell them who I'm like, yeah, yo, I'm, they, I, I'll say your name. Like I'll, I'll be like, yo, I'm bringing uh, Jakey on. Do you guys know who he is on TikTok? They're like, like no, nah, I'm not. I'm like, the guy that goes, now that thing <laughs> is fucking Italian. Right away. Everybody knows the fuck yeah, I'm talking yeah. about. That one really went good, bro. Anything I wanted to that? ask you about that, though. So I know, first, I, I think that was the first video I've ever seen of yours, was the Anthony Rizzo video. 
Oh yeah, in Boston. Did he? Did did he the see jerk that? Jerk off. Yeah, he is? probably no. He just the way he. You know why? Because we were in Boston. He probably didn't know if I was like being a fan of him or nothing. But yeah. just saying, like his name and everything. He he didn't really turn around. And then he finally like slowly turned around. And he probably didn't know like who's gonna fuck you. You know? <laughs> yeah, because you don't know who's so, gonna say what. Yo, I said not. Nah, there was a little kid there, bro. In Boston, you could just walk down to the. You know, like if you don't have a seat, you can't just stand there. People will say something yeah. to you, but they. In in Yankee Stadium, you can't even get to levels without showing your. Yeah, but it's certain ones. Isn't it the ones that's only behind home plate that they check? No, bro, your... you can't go behind the dugout without showing at the top of the steps the guy who's standing. Oh, there. they have the seats that you sit that there. you at least yeah, sit in this yeah, section. Yeah. Boston's not like that. Oh, you could just go wherever you want. Wherever you want in the entire park. The only place that they ask you for your tickets in the park is the oh, green, the green monster. Boston in Boston, not in Yankee Stadium in Boston. Oh, That's why I, he probably didn't know what was going on. Yeah. He might have thought, "Fuck you," whatever. Well, he probably thought someone from Boston was chirping. Yeah. At, uh, so, so um, a, a guy and his daughter was in the front row, and I and I, I said, "You know, I'm not a bad person, bro. I'm definitely not." So I was like, uh, "Rizzo, now that thing is Italian." And I said, and after I did it, I was like, "Yo, really? Why you just say?" They were all laughing. I was like, "You just say fucking Italian, but you." He was like, "No, nah, don't worry, bro." You say it. I say yeah, that shit when I'm at home yeah, with it. Yes, yeah. so <laughs> I was like, "What? All right, where's no, where's no, that thing is fucking Italian." Dude, that shit blew up. Yeah, yeah, but I was doing the, the that's Italian thing for a while, like before that. You know, I was getting an oil change, and I just seen an old school car, and I was like, "That thing." That's what I'm saying. Like I. I would have said that in my car by myself getting my oil change, but I'm just, I get a kick out of it. I say it, and I'm like... To yourself. Yeah, you just laugh at it yourself. And then I'm like, oh, yeah. that thing is fucking oh, Italian. Funny as hell. And then it just, you know, took off from there. And then the... But, uh, I know I know you were chilling with uh, uh, Vogelback. That's his name, Danny Vogelback. Yeah, I know I, that when you were chilling with him. I only Was took, he cool? No, I only took a picture with him for like... It was like a minute and a half. Oh, he was just fun. so swamped by like the what? Ha- yeah, he totally knows about the burger. Thing. I don't <laughs> think he's a fan of it really. Because no, like, you, how folks. do you not hit me? How do you not hit me up and go like, let's let's figure something out. Let's, let's make a video a, or something. Let's do yeah, he's like legendary. It would bro, literally benefit him in so many ways. Man, he a hundred percent knows about you know like that's that's embedded in like baseball culture. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and I'm not even saying that as like a. I'm just saying the guy knows about that and that's doesn't so even funny, hit bro. me up about nothing. Like let's fucking that's bro you you're not Barry Bonds yeah he doesn't you're even, not he doesn't you're even, not okay without the publicity yeah like if you're Michael Jordan okay you don't need the fucking publicity but he's my a guy, big fucking dude you're fucking three strikeouts away from getting dropped <laughs> you know what I mean so fucking are you a Mets fan no no, no you're a Yankee fan right I'm a New York fan though yeah Yankees or or New, uh, Mets I don't care about I, mean, I love I the Yankees. Yeah. Wasn't happy that they didn't make the postseason, but I'm, I'm just gonna say that that was because of Judge sure. with his pussy toe. Sure as it got a got a ring. What was the other pitcher for yeah, the Yankees? He didn't earn that, bro. He gives a fuck. He got a ring. I know he got 19, it. In, was that his second ring? He got one yeah, he had one with the Nats, and now the Rangers. But he didn't even do good in the postseason pitching. No, he got beat. He got beat. He got. They went yard on him a lot, and then he uh, and then he got hit with a fucking what is it called? Oh, he got hit in the arm, right? In the throwing arm? In his elbow or some shit? Oh, Maxi Two Eyes. Maxi Two Eyes, yeah. So, I want to... So, let's circle back to the whole social media bullshit. Because I need... You were telling me some shit the other day that we were hanging out. I want to know your true thoughts on, like... Do you think social media as a whole is benefiting this fucking shit of a generation? Or do you think... Because obviously, there's pros and cons to it. And I know... And one thing that you talked about, too, on that pod you did... And I want to circle back to it because you said some good points with it about the brand deals with kids. And I thought that was because I, bro, I say the same fucking shit. So you were saying like restaurants and businesses uh, will look at someone with like a big following oh, and just yeah, be like, yeah, yeah. oh, we want this kid to promote. Like, but what the fuck is he going to like? What is the restaurant going to get out of this kid Absolutely making the video for that? And I say that all the time. I'm like, because I'll have companies that'll reach out to me, and I'm like, if it doesn't circle into what I do, Why how the it? fuck is it gonna benefit them? Yeah, you because know? they just have money. That, I, bro, everyone wants likes and 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 views, but what? Oh fuck! But it's crazy because you'll have like, th- th- there's this there's this um, bagel place that I know, and it's an older guy that owns the 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 like the bagel company, and he was talking to me, and he's telling me he's like, um, I used to work at this place. And he was like, we got this guy that wants to do videos. He's got so-and-so following. And I looked up the kid, and the, and the dude's views are dick. Yeah, yeah. But he's, but got, he's got 275,000 followers. Plus. 
and because he's an old guy and doesn't know what the fuck What's he's going looking on? at. And even young kids who are, are just still consumers, they don't really know how to dive in and see what's going on. See how non, non, yeah. um, non-impactful non you are. And I was talking to somebody, I've always stressed that I want, you, you aren't as good as me. But I, I shouldn't do that. Like, I shouldn't care yeah. that much. I shouldn't. I like that you're like that, though. What, that like, you're like, fuck you, you can't beat me? No, 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 that you're, that you, like, you won't. You won't kind of just like rob someone in terms of nah, like, because a lot of these kids nah. that are doing like TikTok kids, I won't kids, say they'll fucking you they'll I take they'll take the ten grand whatever it is and then make a shit video for them that gets like a thousand views and just run away. I won't rob people like that, and I won't rob people like oh, that's a cool thing you did. Let me start doing it. Let me start saying what you say. And yeah. You know what I mean? That's fucking. Yeah, like, you know, bro. They all say how you done, and and we either start, we either, we either, were you the how you doing, King? No, I never said. I don't I never said that, bro. That's that's like. Yeah, but you're taking now that thing's Italian to a whole nother fucking level. Yeah, now. but nobody ever said now nah, that thing's Italian. Now people say it, right? Yeah, bro. That was yeah. literally a brainchild of my. Like, you know what I mean? People in in the seventies were saying how you done. Plagiarism, baby. <laughs> Yeah, well, world. life is plagiarism, and I don't yeah. care. Like, yo, people were saying your sister thing, and I, I fucking took that to another That's level. That's crazy you were saying that. 100%, bro, a zillion percent. Yeah, I, and the fact that the Instagram got taken down hurts my chest. Because well, wait, you were saying it on that account, too? Yes, uh, bro. So you have no proof to even no. say these. <laughs> well, like, he has some stories. You got no receipts. No, nah, he has some stories on, on, his, on his page of, of the sister, the sister joke. Like, bro, my group of friends have been saying that, like, you know, we, we were in Halloween, like, 2019, 2018 in AC, and my boy was dressed as, like, a crazy, no, what was he, bro, he, he was dressed as something regular, and he was just drunk, and we were walking out, and a kid was dressed as, like, a crazy clown or whatever, and, say, like, I said something, and my boy was just like, how's your sister, or something like that, and it just, it's been around for so long, but I just don't like anybody b- being copyish. Bro, that's how it is, you see a viral video... You pretty much, I mean, that's how it is. Look at trends now. You're literally just taking a trend and just putting it in your own Bro, shit. Bro, I see these people that live in LA with like, oh my God, like I two to... million, three million followers and shit, but they just recreate viral trends. So easy, bro. It's just not cool. Nope. What is that? It's not natural. No. Not cool. And most of it, I hate to sound like a hater, it's not funny. No, it's dying to, it's dying for exception. You ever been to LA? You, you ever gone out to yeah, LA? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really you went weird. out to LA? Yeah, yeah, really weird. I went out to LA too. I like it and I hate it. Oh, I had nothing good to say about it. Yeah, no, like I like it because it's like Miami. You're like in oh, nice. You're, that kind of, yeah. you're in nice vibes. Like you're away from home. It's a vacation, but then it's horrible because it's like, whoa, these people are weird and yeah. and the energy out there is crazy. And you went out there with more. I never went out there with. I went uh, there. Yeah, but did you go out there to collab with people? No, see, I I never went out there, quote unquote, like clout. Like I didn't go. I went so out I there. Did. Before I was really like, uh, you know, it's quote unquote like, you know, bigger, on bigger, media. bigger on the internet. I went there when I had an Instagram, but not like now. Yeah, but, it's, it's um, a, but that's good that you're transferring your shit over to IG because that's literally. Well, no, yo, that's where I started. Oh, you started on I IG. I started on Instagram, and somebody I was talking to told me that um, you got to do TikTok. And I was like, I'm not doing. Th- I'm not. I don't want to oh, have to. What? Bend. Oh, so you yeah. really are a fucking Instagram. Yeah. Oh my god Yeah I but didn't start TikTok Nah no, bro TikTok did not make me start uh, Content Holy shit I yeah. thought you started Wow that's crazy Wow no, that's Instagram is stories on Instagram You were only just posting Oh you were just reposting We didn't have story. reels on yeah, Instagram Yeah yeah No 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 I was just gonna say Videos you doing reels. We had videos And, you, and you, you'd have like Views on the video That was But it wasn't like reels Where it was like TikTok Yeah You know what I mean oh So That's when we really started how much has the how much has the social media game changed Change, now compared yeah, yeah. to when you, you first? I don't even like think of it. You just keep going with it. But now oh, that I'm sitting here worse, talking to you, dude. it's crazy the change. Bro, I woke up this morning to a girl to a girl breastfeeding her kid. Oh yeah, I did a video about one of those things too. Just tit nipple out and everything. How does that not get removed? Because it's motherhood. I, I just I, he's got a bottle opener. Sorry, to, sorry, to destroy my keys. The you're good, bro. I saw that. I was watching that this morning. I mean, I, I get that. I mean, it's normal. I'm not going to say it's not normal. But do you think there's a time and place? Place, yeah, no. And a, and Yo, a, you know what I was thinking? This is a great a great thing. So I'm driving. We're driving here just now, and we've seen the thing on the side, a bunch of tr- firewood, and it says, don't steal. 
I've seen that in a lot of like, you know, when you go up to Pennsylvania, when you go up to these like more up to statey vibes yeah. and 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 places like this. You can't do that in in liberal ran states. And well, I'm not even being no. political or nothing like that. Like liberal ran state, liberal ran cities and states. You can't have like free peaches in New York City and expect people to Venmo the sign that's there. Like you know how it, it like yeah, I, yeah, went, yeah. I went up I went up to um upstate with with uh with somebody and and we went like uh to to these farm things and somebody just had a fucking a little farm open thing with a free you walk in and it's freezes and everything and you take meat you take everything they have and then you just send them and a- you write it down in the book what you took and send Venmo them bro you know and oh. nobody's there you know it's on their property and stuff like that but. Can't do that in New York City, bro. That you shit would be gone. In L.A. In you can't do that instant. in Detroit. You can't do that in the uh, in the fucking yeah. liberals ass city. So what does that mean, bro? You know what I mean? Like, what is that? That's 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 crazy. That means that something ain't going right in that party. And I'm not saying fucking Republicans are good too, but no, no, like liberal ran cities. So, no, I, dude, I look at me. I, every fucking video I make, the wrong and they're fucking nuts. nuts. Majority of them belong in insane asylums. You want to hear hear another deep thought I had while I was driving here? Give like, me all the fucking like info, your, baby. Your phone, bro. Your phone knows you know, knows you way more than anything. Not because of what you say, but like you wouldn't just give your phone up to ev- anybody to see what you look up, to see what type of porn you like, to see. Anything that you Google, anything that you talk to people in the DMs, anybody you text, you wouldn't just feel okay with with anybody in this room yeah. seeing that. But you know who always sees it all the time? The fucking the government? No, the government ain't even looking. <laughs> That's why when you accept the cookies, they're hearing everything yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah, no, listen, they they but they actually would have to have somebody go over it to really focus on it. Yeah. But what doesn't need to go over it and focus on it as a human is the actual database and the computer itself. Like, there is no... When I have to think of what happened three days ago, I have to search for it and then bring it to the front of my brain, and that takes time. Computers... Right away. Yeah. Like, you could go back 400 years or whatever, and, and they don't need to say, oh, computing, computing. You know, they sometimes do compute a little longer, but the, they're getting faster and faster, and it knows everything. It knows, I right, Duke Crazy, likes bro. this type of shit. Duke likes that type of shit. And guess what? Duke kind of looks like person B because they have the same type of eyebrows. Let's see how, how similar they are. Oh, shit, people with these eyebrows like products like this. And it's the same thing. It's like the algorithm on bro, these Bro, it apps. just gets to compute and yeah. keep learning and learning and learning. Like, we could learn all... When we learn throughout the day, at night, our body gets rid of shit that it feels like it doesn't need to doesn't, remember. The yeah. computer never gets rid of anything. It just saves the everything. The computer knows I need to know everything. There's never wash it down, make it simpler. Yeah. So they have everything. I kind of wish my head was a computer so I could memorize certain shit. I wish I'd gotten to like fucking program writing and stuff like that. Imagine. Those guys are never going to fucking fail. You'd be like Karen from fucking Spongebob, the thing, the fucking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. That creates everything. You'd be able to create like even just how they make this, uh, the logo and shit like that. Like you you have to tell a computer to do that. It's crazy. Technology's scary, dude. you, You could literally be talking about Starbucks and then you go on your phone. How crazy is this? And thing? it just pops up when you talk into this. It just counts vibrations and shit like that. And how does it record your voice onto the thing through the wires? Yeah, it's nuts. Records your exact. Wow, you're making me like you're making me fucking like exact. <laughs> like yo, bro, what I'm saying scary. right now. What is this doing? That's traveling through these wires into the computer to create fucking science. Yeah, Bill Nye, baby. Somebody had to create us or something. Whatever what do you think be. created us? I don't know. I like to believe in God. Do you think, do you think, like, do you believe in aliens? Yeah. I think anything do you is think possible. Do you think we're the reason why they don't want to come down and see us? Yo, maybe. I don't know. They say things like about the, uh, I think the Mayans or the Incas or whatever, the ones that just disappeared off the face of the planet. <coughs> That's because they that were shit like, throws me off too, so bro. Advanced. I think about that shit all the time. Like they were so advanced and the aliens said, uh, or aliens or God said, wow, you guys are good people. You guys des- deserve to elevate to the next level. I don't know. Who knows? Nobody knows. Uh-huh. You don't watch sports? Barely. Damn, I bro. like the Yankees. That's like it. You don't watch men tackle each other on a green football field? I, bro, I don't think I've ever watched a football game. You don't watch men run at high speeds with big muscles and tackle each other? Why? Is that what you like? 
I'm just saying. It's, it's a little like, sus. It's extremely interesting. I don't understand how you don't watch freak athletes. I watch motocross. Do you know motocross? Sport. What, the one dirt, dirt bikes? bikes? Yeah. I know all about that. Really? All about that. I used to race growing up. Yeah, you know how to upshift and downshift? Bro, I was I, I placed 31st in the nation. Yeah, but can you do backflips and shit like that? No, that's fucking like Travis Pastrana yeah. shit. And it's so funny because everybody, that's the first thing they ask me when I mention it about dirt bikes. They're like, like I'll, I'll be talking to a chick and they'll ask me if I've done any sports. Do and I'll be like, I race dirt bike. Donkey bikes. whip? What's that thing? It's called a whip. Yeah, it's called a whip. But they'll be like, do you backflip? Like, no, bitch. That's freestyle. That's I crazy. race them. There's a difference. Yeah, There's what? freestyle. Do you know you know Travis Pastrana? Yeah, yeah. Of yeah, course. yeah. Nitro circuit. Yes. You kind of look like uh, Street Bike Tommy. Really? Yeah. You ever gotten that? Fat, bro. I mean, he's not fat, but you bald and disgusting. Nah, he's not. Huh? Is he bald? Guys calling me fat, bald. No, I'm not. I'm not call, I think I don't know if he's bald. What? Well, well, oh, Seth Rogen. Am I on your shit list now? Chris Pontius, yeah, Chris Pontius, and Brad Pitt, bro. Don't get it twisted. <laughs> yeah, I know what that means. Okay, ski. That's when, like, if you that's see when. a cute girl or somebody with a big booty or you trying to holler at somebody, or that's, they call it the geek car. The geek car. The geek is a crackhead, yeah, dope fiend. Like, when you dope see geeks where I'm from, that's a geek car. Like, if you see some geeks on the other side of the street, like, ski, so they know you got that shit in. That's how uh, bro, her hair looks like plastic. Oh, my God. That's his favorite. That's that's someone, Jakey's favorite rapper of all someone time. Someone enjoys laying down with her and sexy red. Smelling her neck. So I'm going to call her yeah, sexy what blue. Would you do? What would you do? Tell him. Tell him. Yeah. Oh, he'd wrap her up in a semolina and well, fuck that. What would you do? What would you do? You, wait, you would smash? <laughs> oh, my God. That motherfucker on that joint. <laughs> Man, she smells definitely bad. Bro, she probably smells like a Percocet. If a Percocet Ugh. had a smell, it would be sexy She red. smells like sweat and not goodness. Like you know, you know, like when somebody's ba- been at a rave for mad long and their body got like some type of musky scent on it. That's what she smells BL, like. Baby. She smells like that with like expensive cologne or perfume sprayed on it because she got a good record deal. You know what I mean? But underneath that three hundred dollar cologne, you could smell that that secret layer. She blew up out of nowhere, though. I know these guys. They, they know, that's they're just one hit wonders, and that's like all you need. Yeah, honestly. That's literally I'm all sure you need. I'm sure they made, they made music. Like, they, bro, these people these people are making music, grinding for a long time, and then it looks like it's... Like, think about it, bro. When somebody blows up, blows up with TikTok, you're like, oh, blew up. Well, you know, you start seeing them overnight, that but he was making 30,000 videos Yeah, that's the that. same thing with, like, the comedians. Like, Matt Wright. I'm really the only one yeah. that fucking did it first and just blew up. You know what I mean? Yeah, you, honestly, bro, you <laughs> fucked up. Why you were doing it for a long time before nah, you, before bro, it blew I, up? I'm, all, I'm. I feel like you're the type of kid that like just one video you needed to do with what you did and it and it would have went. Yeah, but my first video wasn't even me, bro. I was making fun of my brother. Yeah, but you wasn't your face or whatever. No. What do you mean you were bro, just filming them? Bro, I gained I gained fifty thousand followers on TikTok mm-hmm. and it was only my brother. But you were filming them and talking shit. Yeah, but I wasn't. My face wasn't. Yeah, yeah, in his, yeah. But, but I was. I was talking shit to him. A lot of videos for me is just on like voice. I remember. I held. I held a starfish in front of his face. I said, "Damn, bro, I bet but you, you wish the, there was a sea star so your leg would grow back." But you did the voice. You did the character. No, I didn't do the character. Did it just like this. Did it just like this. Oh, all right, and it did good. That's good. It did pretty good. So that's huge. But once you did the character, though. <sighs> but it was crazy because people really thought I sounded like that. Yeah. Your your fun the funniest video of all time is that dude picking up that the four oh five. Four oh five for five. Bro oh, oh, in the John, union. Yeah, <laughs> in the, yo yeah, that is that. hysterical, bro. Yeah, we were at the gym. We were going to the gym. I was like, yo, bring all your shit in. That's let's me and my brother's favorite video bring ever. Bring all your shit in. Yeah, let's do that. And uh, and I filmed that so long ago. Bro, but see, that's the thing, bro. If you started doing that every time you went to the gym. Yeah, bro. that'd be a whole new thing. Like, bro, yeah. union dudes at the gym just yeah. lifting weights, but don't tell nobody. Nah, sh- we shouldn't even be saying nah. this between me and you. Just, yeah. You could just run with that shit, bro. Yeah. And then you got the, cause then you got the union yeah. fucking union lives matter shirts. Yo, my and boy shit. tells me I like the union meetings and everything. Everyone bro. knows about it. Oh, they so all know about your shit. Well, I'm no, sure. No, just like about it. The union, union lives. Oh yeah, yeah. Shit like that. Whether it's me or not, it's cool that they they know who I am. But what's cool is like they know the movement. Yeah. Like there are times when you know what we were at we were in Boston and I was we were at a bar and we were just chilling, talking, having beer and and it was just regular like this and then, then oh what are you doing, baby? 
And the person was like, wait a minute, right? The, the, the bartender was like, wait a minute, are you the guy? You know what I mean? So yeah, bro, you sometimes don't sound it's just nothing. a voice. Yeah. Sometimes it's just a voice that people remember, and that's cool. I don't care. I don't need the recognition as my face. Yeah. I like the, the recognition of the movement. That's Nobody awesome, bro. sets waves more than that. That union shit, though, bro. Bro, you union, that's Italian, and and Danny Burgers, bro. Really, like, those are major wave, wave, in, uh, yeah. You know, and I'm not even being a dick. It's just everybody else has the same wave. They they create a little ripple. Like, it's not even a monster wave. The bro, wave. the second a video goes something on viral on whatever the fuck it is, you could run with that forever. Yeah. Because they clearly liked it. They liked yeah. it for a reason. So if you continue to do it, what's so you just got to. about us, bro, is we literally just do great things and then just, like, forget about it. Like, we did, we're doing a wrestling thing, like, where we were, we were actually wrestlers. You like wrestling? Yeah, like, you know, just doing the promos, cutting promos. Like you'd for be, a video, be good that we'll do that with you too. Yo, tell me, bro, you I'm know in. how wrestlers cut promos? Like WWE wrestlers? Yeah, cutting promo means like I'm gonna fight him next week, and we cut promos. I'm gonna kill him when we get into the ring, and you know, you like could totally you, be a WWE. Yeah, so <laughs> you're you're selling the fight. That's it's a fucking Broadway show. You know, they I'm don't in. just tell you come out and wrestle. They tell you, okay, these two people are gonna wrestle, and he, he doesn't like this person because he he went against them. They used to be friends, and now he's wrestling with the enemy. And they drag that story on for three episodes. Where the fuck do they po- what do they post that? No, that's that? that's what wrestling is. That's what WWF is. Oh no, is. yeah, yeah, yeah. When you watch so, WWF, it's not just wrestling. No, it's, yeah, yeah. It's them in the locker room, and I'm gonna kill them. Yeah. And yeah, the behind the scenes shit. Setting up yeah. a story, and then these people battle. So yeah. we were just doing straight up story, no battle. Wow, that's sick. Then we had an idea where we wanted to actually write a whole, a whole wrestling like WWE show, comes. like a whole show, like a 20 minute show, film it. Edit it like like an actual, yeah. you know what I mean, and then put it on like OnlyFans or something like that, and have and people, have people pay, pay to watch it. it. Yeah, yeah, that's huge. But have like a 20, 30 minute. But you need like, you know, that's what I was telling you. It's fucking stressful when you're running the race alone, or even just two people. You know what I mean? Like I want a team where I could say these ideas, and then now people will run with it, and then check back in and be like, "Yo, what, what do you think about this?" And we'll either go, "Yeah, no," but when you got to do everything yourself, do this. It's easy. It don't work. So easier said than fucking done too. Yeah. People are always like, ah, like people tell me all the time, like just do the podcast by yourself, like you'll be fine. I'm like, <laughs> yeah. What do you want? My shut head is your so mouth. Big, like, Jesus. Don't fuck. fucking dumb people talk to you. Don't bro, let dumb I people sit in this talk chair, to you. Bro, I be shit in bricks. Bro, it's hard enough trying to talk to somebody in an interesting fashion. What yep. the fuck do these people think? You know, only psychotic mental people could do that, and people like that still. Set up a whole story, not a story, but set up the whole entire show. Like these radio analysts and stuff like that, they set it up. They yeah. know who they're going to talk about and then who they're going to talk about. You know, James Harden, he has, there's something wrong. You know what I mean? They have whole, they just ramble on. Being talking by yourself is rough. Yeah. That's yeah, because you have mean. nothing, you're just off the dome. Nothing to say. Yeah. And especially to- long form shit like this, too. Like it's like fucking. Some people got it though. Like I listen to certain like podcasts all the time to try to study shit, and people are fucking do by themselves. They're like robots. Yeah, like Bill look at Dio Vaughn. He could do if he could be by himself, fucking forty podcasts in a row, and it'll Yo, hit every time. Yeah, he's because he's a little out there. What That's did I another just thing say? too. Yeah, he's a, yeah, is he? What did I just say? You have to be out there to do that. Yeah. You know, we're still kind of engraved in 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 society, and like we're not fucking lost. You know, we're like pretty cool and pretty pretty nuts. Yeah. Let me show my belly a little bit over there. Would you ever do stand up? Nah, we did it. <laughs> <laughs> Why you were thinking about it? No, we did it. We did it twice. We um Bro, was, that takes that balls. takes I don't ever want to think about a joke and then re say it. That's what that that's, is. I'm, I literally say the exact thing. It's not a reaction. No. That's how, we were talking about that too Remember, when we were last I together. I'm telling you, you're really good at that. <laughs> and you're really good at that because you do natural reactions and it seems like it fucking was just happening was just like you know like, you like you, the screams it does it blow your eardrums out nah bro your <laughs> character it was very I, you know and it's cool to meet you and know that like it's not just me it's not yeah. who you know but it is who you are like that's what i always try to tell to these people like yo i'm not playing a character that's really who i am yeah just not all the time you know I'm, i don't have split personality but I'm a normal, you know, and there's a thing on a fucking you got gun. This, what are you bro, doing? This is what you got to yeah. a fucking heart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got we all got feelings, man. Yeah. I have days that I no, sit we my have car. feelings more than other people, bro. Some people oh, are yeah. cold bastards. Bro, I'd be depressed as 
fuck a lot yeah. of the times with this shit. He's pretty cold. He don't I'll know. sit in my car and cry. That boy don't got no feeling just, now. I'll sit in my car and cry, but I won't post it on the internet. Yeah. I'll cry. 100%. Yeah, I don't think I would ever post it on the internet. No? You wouldn't post a video of you on the internet crying? Not because I'm ashamed of it. I'll cry right here on the podcast, but it's got to be natural. Dude, I say it every single fucking time. I know, but to feel... To, to For the people, <laughs> if you, you record <laughs> yourself crying on the internet, I hope it gets fucking worse. Yeah. Seriously. Because you have to go through the process of... It's not like... Setting the phone up. That's the same thing <coughs> like with the Get started, Ready With Me videos. Think about a Get Ready With Me video. Oh, yeah, yeah. The motherfuckers getting that's the videos of them waking normal. up out of the bed. Oh, that's crazy. What the fuck is that? that? Yeah, let me just let me just set up my and then the best is I know damn well it takes a couple takes so you got to get yeah. out of the bed, retap it, go back in the bed. That didn't look good. That didn't. Ah, look it good. didn't look good. It didn't really yeah. look like I was tired. And then they do the fake yawn. Like fuck you. Pal. No, but to cry though, because you're going through something emotionally, and yeah. you're supposed to live in that moment, and you're supposed to feel that moment, and throughout feeling that, your brain tells you. That's sad. You know what I think is worse? When you're crying or when you're angry or when you're extremely happy, you're in, in the that moment. moment. Yes. You know what I mean? 100%. Like, have you ever been extremely happy and been thinking about that over there? No. You're so when you're, you're even those bad thoughts, even like crying and feeling like shit, you're supposed to live in that moment yep. and feel that emotion. And if you leave that emotion for something as 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 it's not going to be the same as not even just the same as um. As egotistical and 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 fuck, what's the word I'm looking for? Like, and um, yeah, you're so vain, mm. like something so vain, like you just have to be seen, and it has to be something that's not real. It's fuck, it fucking blows my mind. What about you? Know what I think is worse than that? Um, posting like when so if someone like, and I made a video about this. Somebody like passes away. And I don't know. I just started laughing. <laughs> That's horrible. And they immediately post. Oh, dude. Man. Or the they, pic- they, that. Or the picture. I personally think, and I tell people this every time, when, when, when I die, don't you fucking dare put me on the internet. All life was the hand thing makes me mad when they're at the hospital and, and they oh, take a picture of they the did hand. A, they did a thing like that in Family Guy. You ever yeah. seen that episode of Family Guy? Oh, they when Peter goes look at the team, he's like, "Oh, look, a hospital chair," and he goes lays in it, and then he posts it and he puts it up, and it's getting a bunch of likes. Yeah, and he's yes, like, "Oh, yeah. well, I didn't want this to happen." Yeah, yeah you did, yeah. bitch. You wanted the attention. That's why you posted it. It's all it's for attention, so, bro. Yeah. That's what social media is. I don't know, but I don't ever post for attention. I post to laugh. That's it. And like me and him come up with shit, and it's funny, and then I post it to either laugh or because you're real, bro. Yeah, just I just want to laugh. That's all I want to ever do is laugh. Do you, Sometimes yeah, I want to. You, you, you definitely enjoy seeing. I, I mean, obviously you do, dude. That's why I do. But you obviously enjoy seeing other people laugh with you, like that shit. I, I love. That I enjoy shit. people. I enjoy people enjoying it as well. Yes, I definitely I love that enjoy. Shit. Like, oh yeah, right. I love when you shirt back at people in the comments. Oh, bro, I always. I was looking at your recent video. Always, I answer every comment, bro, because the engagement goes up crazy. Easy. You're smart with that. I stopped but doing that. It's not that. even. It's not even like I used to talk to people who did Instagram who were at low levels, and it's like, what are you? Tr- what are you trying to portray? That yeah. nobody, that you don't see none of the comments, bro. You got eighteen thousand followers, like, and and you got sixty comments. You posted something and you didn't look. You didn't see those comments, like, bro. You're not fucking Brad Pitt, and you're not uh, Angelina Jolie. Like, I'm not going to lie. I, I, I sound like an asshole. I do look. I, I yeah, stop, but you have a thousand comments. I stopped answering them because I was getting violations on them. Yeah, and it was no, fucking my say, account. Yeah, you can't And say I feel bad things. because I get a, I get comment. Bro, I, I got a violation one time. I said thank you. I literally wrote thank you and it got a violation. Yeah, but you don't even use your Instagram. Like you don't. No, I just go on and post and get off. Yeah, you don't, you, don't, you don't use your Instagram. These people who do that use their Instagram and like the lifestyle of Instagram. Yep. So you don't answer. Good? Who the fuck do you think you are? Yeah, bro. People use it for a different. I mean, it, it's it's. I don't know. Yo, I love abusing people in the comments. I was and I and I I was getting like um, I was getting kind of like kind of kind of what is it called? What it's like? Not fear of missing out. Where it's like uh, deja vu kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where it's because I, I used to do that. Yeah. So I was looking at you in the comments. I'm like, oh my god. 
Yo, some people I miss really that make so me angry because I want to physically, like I said, punch them in the face. And just like, yo, say that to me. <laughs> say that to me in person. You would never. And I make sure I tell them, like, you would. Yo, never that's so. Say that to me in person. That's so. That's so New York. Yeah, but that's yeah, so like, yeah. like in New York, you don't say hi by saying hi. A yeah, hi yeah. is a punch to the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I always say that. Yeah. Like in Jersey, like Jersey kids are fucking. Vaginas, <laughs> they they do. They like. No, nah, but they the, get like rowdy. Like they you know, they do. But New York, you're young. You'll get the, fucked up over there. Back in the day, bro, like those those like younger those older Italian kids that are not like in their fifties and sixties, but in their forties. They yeah. used to like, they used to bang, bro. They used to like fucking, they were nuts. Like, oh, the kids in Staten Island, the kids in Staten Island now, they do stupid shit and they stuff. Always want to like, fight. Yeah, but it's like it's not, bro. In the in the nineties and shit like that, like those kids were fucking tough kids. Yeah. Those what about, but, but like, do you think like Italian kids now, like the ones that are like super Italian, like in I don't Staten think Island, they're tough now. if they went to Italy, oh no, <laughs> that people would laugh at you. You're not Italian. You're fucking an American kid. People would laugh at me weird. wherever I go. If I went to Puerto Rico and said I'm Puerto Rican, they'd laugh. If yeah. I went to Italy and said I'm Italian, they'd laugh. If I went to I- Ireland and said I'm Irish, they'd laugh. And if I went to uh, Jew name, uh, Jew St- Jew Stein, wherever <laughs> Jewish people are from. They would tell me, bro, you're not Jewish. You know what I mean? That's where my back, my like uh, ancestors are from. But you're not that. You're not fucking Cuban and Italian, bro. Bro, when I went to Cuba, I was like, you were out of like, this place. Is, this is me. You were out of place. Like, yeah, that's where your heritage is from, shit. But you're a fucking American kid from Belmont. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Jersey changed me. When crazy, did you? When bro. did you move to Belmont? Uh, I moved here, 2018. So how bro, old were you? I turned like, bro. I was when so I was. You have a lot of your York. life in Jersey. You weren't like you. What were you like twelve nah, when you left I was, Westchester? I was. I was. Uh, so the house that I'm at was like a. It was a shore house for a long time. So it was kind of our getaway from our house. In oh, New Belmont. York. Yeah, and then you just moved full time. And then I was like, "Fucking mom, like I love you, but I gotta get out of here and live on my own." Yeah. Like, love my mom to death, but I just couldn't live under her rules. It was just too much of. I like, know. So what's Belmont? What's Belmont? Belmont is like bro, not a place a during town. the winter, right? And it's great. Cause bro, I just be chill. bro. I'll, I'll literally chill on my porch with my nuts hanging. Nobody's there. That's not healthy mentally neither. Sometimes though, bro, the breeze that I get on my I know, berries, but you get a little lost, no? In the sauce. Oh yeah. Like when there's nobody around, you can go stir crazy. Bro, I'm telling you, I have nights where I like I, I I'll have full blown conversations with myself just to like real. Like I, I forget some, what I sound like. That's like on some I live at a, a haunted like a haunted yeah. house type shit. But I like being alone, dude. I, I love know, my own company. I love being alone, but it, it, it's it's. But not, it's it's. I know it's not good for me in terms of like. It gets addictive. My yeah, my social skills are not what they Up used to, to be. <laughs> yeah. But then it gets addictive, bro. Like where where now you have to be with people and you're like. I don't like it. Yeah, like and I, I feel like an asshole, bro, because like my mom will come <laughs> visit me like certain Damn. weekends and it's like I'm so grateful when she comes to visit. But then I'm just like, get away from me. Oh, my God. I can't wait till you leave. I'm like, damn, I just got I can't wait to just watch TV and just lay down by myself. I know I have that sometimes. Not that good. sucks. And I get I get so mad at myself, bro. It's not I'm like, healthy. I'm like, fuck, dude, why are you like this? Like, why can't I don't know? It's just some fucking but I'm hyped. Like when I like when I was with you and Nikki and Jojo. Dude, I swear to God, the entire way back home, I, I've never felt like that like in my life. Like I've Yo, never felt it's that just happy. A, a kick it and chill. It's just the energy. Like yeah. you guys have energy, and like my shit was low, and it was just like I felt like breathe, I put my fucking life self into on a battery yeah, charge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, damn, I feel like the energizer bunny right now. Yo, bro, that makes like me really triple happy. A's, baby. That makes like, me really fuck. happy. And also, bro. too, I'm from New York, so I know how that lifestyle yeah, yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. Like I grew up with it. I've been living there since for 18 years. So it's like. I felt like I was with my boys back home. Bro, and you've done so much doing it alone, Dude, too. Dude, really fucking, yeah. you know, you're b- big on TikTok and everything like that. Like, you're yeah, a, I mean, a household TikTok face. But I, there's a few of them, you know what I mean? Like, there's a few people that are just in everybody's algorithm, and you're one of them. Yeah. That's huge. Young kids, too, you know, maybe not old. It's funny, I get people, people. From, from, like, my high school that'll hit me up and be like, hey, remember when you had me in, uh, I had me in like Remember social studies class. Like, bitch, I are. fucking hated you when I was in class with you. I fucking hated you. Was not a fan of you at all. <laughs> yeah, people but fucking suck. They do. They really do. So but you watch know, no do, sports so at do you all? like the whole? Do you like the whole getting recognized lifestyle? Like, is that for you? Or yeah, that, that, I like that. Like that's cool. really? It doesn't bother me at you all. Like when someone buys you a drink, that's the only thing I like with it. Nah, I rather not that because then I have to then I have to really stick around. Oh, that's true. You know what I mean? Yeah, I you can't, don't want to be a dick. I can't. I can't just. I can't just fucking. Oh, all right, thanks, bro. Later. 
And I want to talk to you like if you're cool and everything like that. But I mean, sometimes I don't want to fucking have full conversations up, about, you know. But the it lack is cool. Of respect with people is crazy. I've been uh, guys always pretty cool, man. You know, nobody really fucking. I don't mind when like people. Not 100%, I, I man. can notice somebody notices me before they say something, because the stare wow. and the and the vibe is different. My but I, I don't mind it. I like that. I, I and I appreciate that they they could. They could tell me that that like makes them happy. Like today, we were at the rest stop and somebody said something when we, we when we got Panda Express. Oh really? Yeah, yeah. he was like, "You Jake, right?" I was like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." yeah. Bro, now that shit's dope. I, I mean, I, I get it more good than obviously bad. Yeah, I've never with, had with some uh, encounters, dick. but the bad ones, I'm like, Yo, "Fuck, see, dude!" And I try to be that. so nice. Dude, I'm out. I'm fucking no, nice as shit, in dude. In person, but you're, you're like a dick on me. Yeah, so then they see that. They, they don't know you're yeah, nice. They yeah. know you're a dick. You know what? This podcast is going to see that side of me. Yeah. They're going to see the normal voice. Yeah, but you got to st- come in with short content, too, with that. Getting get in the, the traction on long content is harder than oh, those yeah. quick ones. Oh, yeah. So the quick and being ones, consistent But with you're it? more of like a TikTok person, bro. You don't... You don't like, I don't look like a TikTok person? No, say so you're more of a TikTok person. Oh, yeah, 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 like yeah. You yeah. don't... You have a big following on Instagram, but you don't use it as like what you're doing today, like type shit. No, you you know you it's like a it's like a work no, thing I, for I don't, you. Yeah, and that is good. But, but it could be no. Yeah, sometimes you need cons. to let them in a little bit to life. Like they need to see Duke at at the like you you don't post on your story, do you? I do, but only to like fucking repost someone that yeah, mentioned like, bro, me. Bro, show them how you I don't live. know, bro, because I go into the app and I just like I see don't all the notifications. It. I know, and I but freak out, dude. Bro, that's why I don't. That's one. That's why I don't follow anybody because I just get yeah, like, yeah, see everybody just, shit. But just fucking go in, don't like a day in the life kind of thing. Yeah. You know what's so funny? I made one of those videos, a day in the life, and people liked it. So I'm like, fuck. Yeah, you could even do vlogs. Do I do too. it again? But I'm like, ah. nah, I don't do a fucking vlog. Just do do like, do. I was gonna get back on the YouTube vlogs though. People love that. No, that's huge too. But it, it's also that takes time to think about yeah. it and put into work. Yeah. Opposed to fucking but, just um, film shit. I see you. Uh, I ha- I have to say this because I, I wrote down I was looking at it. You. Uh, oh, actually, I want to talk about your thoughts on canceled. So shit like. So what? I'm saying oh. like how brands get canceled. Like remember yeah. when Carhartt. What happened with got, that? Got uh, everyone was trying to cancel Carhartt because they got they mandated the vaccine. No, I didn't know that. You never heard, you never knew about that. No. Learn all that shit. People were started throwing out all the Carhartt shit because they mandated the vaccine and shit. So everybody started to just not fucking wear. Same thing with Bud Light. People stopped drinking Bud Light because fucking they had the, the transgender. Because they had the transgender stuff. If you're if Heineken decides to have, someone a girl with a cock. What are you talking about? This isn't that. Oh, whatever that is. This is green beer. It's a green beer. It's fucking. <laughs> it's uh. It's uh. It's tape blue tape beer. <laughs> blue tape beer. Blue that tape blue green tape beer. beer. You just, would you just stop drinking it? If they no, I don't give a fuck. You don't give a fuck, right? Nah, and, you know. I think that sh- I Not personally think that shit is ridiculous. Thing. I still drink ridiculous. a Bud Light. I don't give a fuck about that. It's just, it's just they're so stupid because their audience isn't that in any way, shape, or form. But nah, I'm not gonna lie, Bud Light got nah, fucked. Nah. They got fucked. Look bad. at Disney, bro. Bad publicity about them changing all the characters and yep. shit like that is not good publicity. Their numbers are crashing right now, bro. Yeah. Stock wise yeah, no, and shit goes down. Crazy. So bad publicity is in Kanye's life. Bad publicity is good publicity, like but not Kanye? for big corporations. He's we always talk about Kanye. In here. He's my favorite. He he uh, nuts, he just said he has lost. autism. Yeah, he's a little lost now. He likes to lean into the. He's lost, but he's great, bro. He's a smart guy. He just doesn't know how to fucking to uh to figure it out. No, to like um express himself. Yeah. You know, he has good thoughts, but he expresses them in such a j- Weird dickhead way, right? dickhead way. Ooh, you like that? Dickhead you would look so good kid. in that hat. Take a couple I got to get I got to give you some shit. I I give you shit here, but I uh I have to I, I hate to be an asshole. You nice. Why why you, you say I'm too too skinny for I'm too a fat. Yeah, you're way too skinny for the windbreakers. What, you got a windbreaker? Yeah, I wanted to give you it. Yeah, I love windbreakers. And I, It's got and that whoosh, whoosh, whoosh sound. Oh yeah. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I like They'll turn that. into fucking Batman with that shit. Jump off of a fucking Guaranteed. hill and get the wings. <laughs> <laughs> and glide into your but, sister's um, box. So what's 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 new? Jupiterman? <laughs> he, he's always like... He gives me good lines and stuff like that, so he's big. Yeah. So now, so that's we what, fucked up not giving yeah. you a mic, bro. That's, that's on right. us. He's behind the camera. Next going, time you gotta let that. That's I'm, I, I hate to be a dick, but I'm blaming that on you. I know I should have. I'm I sorry. Yeah, I I'm said, sorry, yeah. but I'm also gonna blame no, that on 100%, you because I would have been I fucking. I should have told you. Yeah, I do. Oh, that's it. 
<laughs> if anybody's doing the killing around here, I'm so what, doing the what, killing. What, around here. <laughs> My cousin touches them, but yeah. You got anything new coming up or anything going on or no? No, like, just you, hanging out with just you chilling? and doing shit like that, bro. I don't like um We gotta yeah. start doing shit more together. Yeah, bro. 100%. Even if it's just hanging out, bro. That's where greatness comes, bro. Just, we don't like plan. It's just like hanging out and like funny shit happens and good ideas yeah. happen. And you go places, bro. Like we've we've gone on little vacations and something legendary always happens. We went on to Dewey and, and just this drunk white idiot started fighting somebody. If those kick in, bro, ideas come out of the wazoo, the fucking Nah, I don't like drinking, bro. Really? It gets me so tired. I love getting hammered. Yo, it doesn't give me life. It gets me like... Uh, I'm a fun time. You know, you know, you know, you, like you feel like an old guy when you start drinking? I just... <laughs> yeah. Yo, you look fucking incredible. You are just... You, you know what you look like? You look like you're on holiday. Yeah? What's holiday? Seriously. What's holiday? Just You just look like you're on holiday. Well, I'm on my four day now. Here we go. A four now day. I got to right turn into a five day with a... That's fucking it. Italian. Yeah, well, this ain't that Italian. You know what it is? Is that I like to, bro. I, I'm really legend that as far as like, I wear, no, I, love, and I, I wear super skinny jeans and I then wear that. these. I've always been like that. Like even junior high school, I, I love baggy, I love tight, I love preppy, I love rocker, I love all of it. The only thing, just don't get a Brock top haircut. That's uh, what when they ass. do broccoli hair. Just don't get a perm. Yeah, the hair yo, is fucking beautiful. I and wish. That's thing. Don't you dare cut that. No, no. When I was a kid, bro, I wanted to have curly hair so uh, badly. I didn't know about perms. I would have started the perm 15 years ago. You would have been the night next I'm top guy. So, I'm so angry that they started the perm when I was like, now these kids are doing it. I didn't know. I wanted curly hair too when I was a kid. I have a hoop here. No, but not, yeah, uh, but that's 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 fine. Uh, would you ever get like the chandelier? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I did been had that. Oh, nice. I hate that the kids do it now. Like, it's kind of, it's the way they do, the way they and wear it now. And now it's like dead ass, no cap type. You know, they make fun <laughs> of people like that. Like, if you look like that, then you're dead ass, no cap. And I hate that person. No riz. Wait, wait, the chat's going crazy. The chat is going crazy. Is the chat going nuts? Oh, the, oh, 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 the chat's telling me to pull my dick out. Should I, I pull my dick out for the chat? Who, who, uh, who would you want if me and you could, you could only, you got to stay on this green grass. This green grass, and it's got like boxing ropes on the side. And me and you, full boxing gear against Jack. I would Jack Doherty, Do Doherty and one other person. Who would you, I pick? Jack Doherty. Okay, you pick who Jack Doherty. I would probably do. Who do I hate a lot? I don't like a lot of people. On someone really good that'd be good, good with him. Yeah, because I, I literally want someone that throw I know that body they, into the fucking garage door. Bow, bing, dents in the garage who, who's door. Who's Wait, wait, go, 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 say. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> just head first, bang, Wait, dent the gun garage. He's just on I, the floor. Yeah, I was gonna say him, but I don't want to. I don't want to. Yeah, put him out there. Ah, fucking bro, this kid Brody. He does these get ready with me videos, bro. That's the yeah, kid that he, I. Is he big? Nah, he's like 140 pounds. No, I'm saying line. is he big? Like, like, like I want. Jack Doherty make a Oh no, no, no! He's not that big. Nowhere near that. So I'm trying, that's why I'm trying to. Oh, 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 oh David beat. Dobrik. David Dobrik. Dobrik. David yeah, Dobrik. I don't like him. David Dobrik. I would yeah. put my fucking sneaker in that dude's asshole. Oh, you like asshole. this Tesla? Bow head first. I'll, dude, I'll show window. up to his fucking pizza Give me the lines, go. Give me the lines. David you Dobrik's Dobrik? the guy who always gives He's people He's the asshole Teslas. that that's... He, first of all, you ever see his shit on Snapchat? No. Fuck that dude. He's huge, bro. He doesn't get ass. Yeah, but he's definitely making millions. And when you make oh, yeah. millions, you get ass. Mm. You know, bro, you could literally be gay and get ass. You know mm. that girl, that girl, Corinne Koff? Yeah, she was in that Corinna. video where the kid got punched in the face. I, I didn't know who she was until that video. She sells oh. pictures of her naked body for five dollars. You wish that the security cents. guard missed and hit and hit uh, a woman. Jack, no, no, no. <laughs> no oh, Jack. Jack was so that guy would have been fucking blind. <laughs> Spin him around three. You had to be blind to hit Jack, bro. Jack was like, you know, and he Jack seen him get hit and he was like, all right, you know, I'm out of here. I think it was Jack's security guard though. It was, why did he hit yeah. that kid? <laughs> that poor kid got annihilated. He saw, bro. Uh, he saw pop smoke after he got hit, yo, dude. And, he was, he and was, it was such a, and it was such a bad like. Oof, it was like no, it didn't even like slap like that. Yeah, it but he just, ate that it shit. Was solid, you like, can't lie. Yeah, and no. he was, and he was dressed in a fucking singlet. He looked like, like Richard dip. Simmons, bro. He looked bro, like Richard Simmons. He got, and he got up fast. Wait. But he still was like knocked out. But he. Got, what would happen if you hit the deck like? <laughs> oh, you guys got to get shot. Hundred percent. Got to come back and shoot him. There's no way. We would just. I seen my cousin sent me a video of, and yeah. then I showed him. It was somebody getting knocked out. <laughs> In front of that girlfriend, bro. 
You get knocked out in front of your girlfriend. It's over. That relationship can never oh, she be ain't mended. sucking your dick. It's not even that. It's just she, she lost. Just look, she, she looks, she looks uh, at you embarrassed. as. Embarrassed. Not even embarrassed. You it's don't like, think? Not even. man's just got knocked out. If I was that chick, No, after that. Like, after the fact of that and you guys are at home two days later. Like, you just never will get that same respect from her because you got put into a different uh, headspace while while you were <laughs> some somebody physically hit you and, and your no nah, that video was actually your mind nuts. altered while you were standing next to her and another man inflicted that brain changing <laughs> on you while the woman that's supposed to love you is next to you you can never recover from that and that's like he said you got tomorrow you got to I would fuck, never want to put myself you in that fuck situation fuck somebody up tomorrow in front of her look i could do it but it's still You ever fought okay. someone? Yeah <laughs> Am I gay? <laughs> <laughs> Does that make me gay? I never saying, bought someone. Like, you never fought anybody? <laughs> you just call me gay? That's fine. I sit when I pee, so uh, it's all like good. Like the Later, you never had... I just never, I just never put myself in that situation. Yeah, because not enough people live in, in, in Boynton Beach or whatever. Where do you live? <laughs> yeah, I live in a white, a white area. No, but I mean, it's I'm like, white, bro, but it, during the winter, it's like a ghost. Yeah, like, there's nothing I'm to even about fight. What am I going to fight? Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, the ghost, bro. You got to fight your own mind. That's why you're mad. Yeah, but let me ask you something. If I fall asleep with my mouth open, does that mean I'm giving a ghost head? Head all the time. <laughs> 80% of the time 100% of the time Like what's his name Says with the cologne Work 67% of the time That's 100% of the time Wait you knocked someone out No never knocked anybody out un- Unconscious That's Was this like recent What Like that you punched someone Nah no, last time I punched somebody Was like four, five years ago uh, Probably six years ago I never I've got ne- the privilege Never knocked too. anybody unconscious I want but to But I don't want it to be like Out from where What? Physical confrontation with somebody? You are lying. I've never. With who? What he did? Oh. Oh yeah, yeah. I did. Punch you had him beef, huh? Head. I punched him in his fucking face. <laughs> yeah. But I didn't. Yeah. What? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're but knocking too many people out, bro. No, you look I didn't like knock Jack, Jack Dirty security I guard. I didn't knock him out. I didn't knock him out. He's, bro, he threatened death on somebody. Like, you know, you could say whatever you want to say. When you say you're going to kill me, or, so, you know, I know you're, you're just not get, serious. I know you're not going to do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. But just the utter thought that you could say that to me, that you would take my life. You, you just went up and rocked him? Yeah, he was just standing right in front <sighs> of me. I want to rock him someone bow! so bad, but I, I don't want to just do it, randomly do it. No, you got to. No, I don't do it to the wrong person. He wants me to. Fifty thousand. He, if he gave you fifty thousand cash, you'd stand there right now and let him blast you in the face. I'd punch, I'd knock his dick ten, off. Ten thousand cash. I'd knock the cap off. Ten thousand cash still. You'd take ten. thousand. I'd let you punch me for ten thousand. I might do that, you, bro. You wouldn't take a shot to the, why? Because in case you get fucking, <laughs> you're doing. The <laughs> Yo, he'd start doing the moonwalk if he got hit. Is it on camera? What if? Would you do a ten thousand on camera? Bro, I would do anything for ten thousand on camera. You'd get absolutely punched in the face. anything. Ten no, G's? not by Mike Tyson. I'd probably die, so I wouldn't do ten grand to die. That's like saying, would you? Even if you don't die, you're just never the same after. No, that. you'll they just say, wake, Yo, I'll wake up and have fucking autism. When fighters get knocked unconscious, like where they're they're loopy, like you 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 have a full bar, and when you lose fights, your bar don't really go down. It's when you get knocked that, like when your brain is in a yeah. You know, huh? when your eyeballs are still trying yeah, to catch yeah. each other, like the video game, that's when you lose little pegs of your bar. So even him punching you in the head and you not dying, yeah, you're, bro, on like you're gonna be a little bit HP. different, bro. Yeah. yeah, and you don't get that HP yeah, you don't back. Get that HP bro. back. That HP There's just no, keeps going lower no and lower. How much cocaine Sooner later, on five percent H- HP. When you do cocaine, you think the HP bar goes to one twenty five, but it doesn't. It stays the same. It's, it, it it goes to one twenty five for about <laughs> thirty minutes, and, and then, then that goes right then back. Then you're at sixty three, sixty three oh, HP, God. and it just get lower and lower. Ed knows uh, about that. But wait. So you don't watch any man sports? No, I, I don't even. Uh, th- well, actually, motocross is a fucking man sport. Yeah, actually, motocross. Not physical. Motocross is the most physically demanding sport yeah, in the world. Yeah, I know. In the world. If you're gay. <laughs> no, for real, though. It, no, 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 no. It is not more physically demanding than one sport. I'll say. What do you think it is? I think it, boxing. No. That's, that's Like jujitsu? No. That's really hard, too. But the number one most demanding Wait, sport, on. bro. Uh. 
Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold you on. Give me like five seconds. Number uh, one most demanding sport that the smallest amount of people are actually professionals in. Oh my god, I can't. It's see. like the smallest group of people that are actually professionals, and they fight tooth and nail to get one of those spots. What is it? Uh, AF. <laughs> How are you gonna hate? Hey? Yo, Formula One racing. It oh. took me a long time. Formula One racing. Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? Go watch Drive to Survive on Netflix and tell me that's not the most physically demanding. A car, a car driver? No, no, not a NASCAR driver. Formula One. Oh, those things are not. What, the cars that are like $7 million a piece? $7 million, bro. Those are billion-dollar companies. That's crazy. And they're cutting going, yeah, yeah, I would not think that that way. I thought you were going to say like fucking badminton bro, or something. you have to see what they do to, to, to get their neck muscles. They got this thing to turn. Bro, they're going G-forces. You, if you get in one of those cars and they drive you, your body would be like, yeah, but a dirt bike, dude, a dirt bike, you don't dirt understand. Bike, going on going? a dirt bike for 30, 30 know, minutes plus just, two laps, bro. Bro, you don't think these guys are doing 30, they're doing 45-minute races. Yeah, but. Doing 300 miles an hour and you know then stopping on a dime difference, to make a quick turn. Uh, yeah, you might. Uh, bro, I got to actually look that up. I never actually. Right I, I've seen, because my uncle watches Formula One, and those cars are fucking watch, insane the way they turn Watch and shit. Drive to Survive on Netflix, bro. It's like they, they make it where it's they show oh, you the right. season. Yeah. It's like, uh, what's the one would they do for NFL? Hard Knocks, kind of, but all the, the teams and they're, what they're going through throughout the fucking season to like yeah. become better and stuff like that. Fuck, I got to do some fucking research. Where you get these fucking cameras from? You, 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 cameras are pieces of shit. Guy guy's been fucking with the cameras camera. since we walked in. But um, you Where'd you get any? these cameras from? I got a oh, guy get CBS. you the camera that you don't ever got to fucking touch. CVS. <laughs> you got fucking jip, bro. Hundred dollars a pop. Really? Mm-hmm. About to go to CVS now. Yeah. Really? Hundred dollars for? Oh, nah, after tax, probably like one fifteen. Yeah, that's a joke, though. Yeah. That's really good. I think that one was like. Well, the like lens probably fifty dollars. The lens. Yeah, bro, I go cheap on it. No, nah, I'm, I'm just, I'm clearly just joking about the, him but, touching it. I hope. Yo, you I want you to be I'll able be to take do, offense. Do you have any? Do you have like? Do you, so, uh, you, have, you have like a website running or nothing right now that you want to? Yeah, like jakebotch.com. Like jakebotch.com. No, just jakebotch. Just jakebotch.com. Jakebotch.com. I know you got the Danny Burger fucking. Yeah, merch tease up. Shit that's like going that. rolling, yeah. folks. This is one of the, if not the coolest creators. If you want to call him creator, because he is just a fucking normal guy, like Creative we all. Perky said, like take we it. all. Love this dude. Loved having this fucking guy on. Jake Botch, you're the absolute fucking man. Hope you Thank had a you, pleasure bro. spending some quality time yeah, with you. Yeah, well, this was, this was, this, this sometimes hit Sometimes I home. feel like fucking, you know what I mean? Because people, people expect something out of me. But sometimes it's one bro, of the you're prob- I, I'm, 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 I'm saying this from rah, rah, rah. You're probably one of the, like, and I've literally FaceTimed my manager, like the guy that does all this for me. Like, after I was like, you're probably one of the coolest dudes I think I've ever met. Oh, I really appreciate Seriously, cause that. I, and I, I get, because I, bro, time. in this field that we do. I told you, bro. There's a risk factor. There's, you know, you, you can't trust people. No, you know, you gotta, you gotta fucking, you gotta watch everywhere you go, cause you don't yeah. know who's gonna be looking to fuck you over and just rob your pockets or God got me, whatever. Bro. My fucking but, mother gave gave me to God at a young age. Uh, so that was, uh, wow, I'm not gonna lie, that was the fucking longest I've spoken in a long time. Why? How long was that? No, I don't know. Probably like over an hour, but more, really? more than how better. long? Over an hour. Over an hour. Uh, anyway, folks, thank you for listening to another episode of Duke It Out with the man Jake Botch himself. Duke It Out. Yeah. Yo, can going? we get, can we get, can we get you saying Duke It Out now? That thing's Italian. We need, we need to get it on the way out. Just be like Duke It Out. I right? Duke It Out. Which night, everybody? Listen, I'm here with Duke, and guess what? I Duke It Out with your sister's box last night. Went 12 rounds, beat the shit out of that broad. (laughs) Now that thing is fucking fucking Italian. Italian. I'm here with Duke, and I just duked it out with your sister's box. 12 rounds, kid. Now that thing is Italian. Remember, folks, if you can make a chick laugh and giggle, you can make that ass clap and jiggle. Love yous, and thanks for tuning in. Oh, shit. Fuck!